for Team USA West. Number 12, Lyndon Lucas. Talk about your summer. Obviously, there's some big news for you. You're coming back to the state of Oregon. Can you tell me what led to your decision and uh, where you're going to be playing basketball next season? Um, you know, what led to it was we just kind of figured if I went down to Finlay, I would come back for a week before I head off to college. And that wasn't really enough time for me to, you know, get back, you know, refresh before I head off. So we just kind of figured uh, coming home for a year before I go off would be the best situation. On top of that, I got trainers, uh, family here that train me um, on the regular that I can go to um, as much as I need. Um, so I can still keep up the level of improvement here and uh, also have fun. Um, go to a public school with kids in it, um, you know, have some of my friends and family be able to watch me. And, uh, and yeah, so we decided on uh, the Westview Wildcats. So. so what's different maybe for you um, since you left? Last time uh, we saw you in the, in the playoffs, I mean, I remember you as a shot blocker and a guy who was really good on yeah. the interior. Um, what are some things maybe you've added to your game? How are you a different player now that you're coming back? You know, I'm an outside player more now. Um, I still have my inside game, so that you know complements each other. Um, I still can shot, block shots, uh, rebound, do all that stuff, defend. Um, but now I can also you know step out, shoot the three, shoot jump shots, handle the ball. Uh, Finlay helped with a lot of that stuff. Also, um, with conditioning, you know, comes running the court. Um, and, you know, just, you know, my body has gotten a little bit um, better since my sophomore year to, you know, two years ago. Um, and so, you know, I feel like, um, you know, people will be hopefully surprised on what they see. Now, looking back on the whole experience, I mean, would you, if you had to do it all over again, would you leave the state again? Um, I mean, what, what did you think about your experience at Finlay? What did you learn from it all? Oh, yeah, I would definitely leave. Uh, I wouldn't take uh, anything away from that. Um, you know, I learned a whole bunch uh, throughout the year. Um, I improved. Um, I went through, you know, the life of a freshman in college, so that's going to help me a lot once I get to college. It might not help me next year, but the year after, um, you know, I already know the schedule, what it's like to travel. You know, now that uh, you played at Sunset before and you're going to Westview now, um, how do you think uh, some of the people over there on the west side are going to feel about that? Um, you know, I, I bet there's going to be some stuff. I got some stuff for leaving uh, to go to Finlay, too. Um, now I'm at our rival. I'm sure the game at Sunset is going to be exciting, so uh, everybody come check it out. Um, but, you know, I'm looking forward to it. Um, and I feel, you know, like... Some people might not like my decision, but um, you know, there's always some people that that uh, don't like what I do, and um, you know, I don't really pay them too much attention. So, can you talk a little bit about your recruitment? Um, mm -hmm. Do you have a list of top schools, and uh, yeah. who are they? If so, um, I got a top seven. Um, it's Oregon, Stanford, uh, Cal, Arizona, uh, NC State, Georgetown, and Kansas. Um, I'm happy with all seven. I'm. Uh, you know, trying to talk to all seven as much as possible. That was the reason for narrowing it down. Um, I'm going to take my official visits in September and, uh, you know, hopefully decide on a school then. And, uh, you know, I'm looking forward to knowing where I go and, uh, you know, then uh, enjoying senior year after that. So. <laughs> Thank you.